Now I wore one of these for quite a few days and the helmet, which is, uh, which is quite a good fit. Uh, I remember the other ones being a bit more um, uncomfortable, but it was so hot that particular summer that any given opportunity we took them off. Yeah, I suppose being in the film is, is part of history really. When we did it, it didn't seem to be that special, but as it's grown and as the merchandise has uh, been sold around the world, it is quite, quite astonishing to be a part of something like that. <laughs> Here we have. Da, 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 da. I played one of these characters in Star Wars. <laughs> well, here we are. Uh, this is a shot of me here, the right hand side. And uh, none of us have our, our helmets on because it was very warm. So we were rehearsing this, then the helmets go back on, and then the cameras turn over. The first scene that the stormtroopers are in, the door blows open, and in they rush. Now, I'm this guy here. The one bending his legs there. All the others just marching in, sort of like waving their guns around. I used to do a lot of film work at the time, and uh, I wasn't originally booked to do the film. Um, but I, I was fortunate enough to do it because uh, someone fell sick, and he, the costume that he wore had the same measurements as, as myself, and so therefore I went along in his place. Here's a call sheet from uh, 14th of April, 1976. Is it? that long ago. Towards the end of the week, I was asked if, if I could uh, fit into a costume uh, uh, f to work in the cantina sequence. Once again, the person that was due to do that cried off sick, so the first two characters I played I, were supposed to be played by other people. <laughs> it's, it's quite difficult to believe sometimes. 38 years later, here I am attending conventions. When I was first asked, six, seven, eight years ago, I thought to myself, this is a joke. No one no, wants my autograph. These guys, uh, they're enthusiasts. And, uh, this guy came along today with a little plastic figure of uh, the character that I played, Soarin, and to get me to sign the box, which is, uh, which is quite, quite, uh, quite a thing, really. Soarin? Cantina bar is one of my favourite scenes, and uh, so I thought I'd bring on uh, this alien for Laurie to sign. He's basically an extra in the cantina bar, the uh, famous scene where they meet Han Solo and Greedo dies. It's what I've come here for today, yeah. Laurie's been telling us all sorts about some of the stuff that I didn't realise about the costume fittings and, and what went on, which is, it makes it for us as a fan real that, you know, these guys tell us these stories of uh, how it happened. <laughs> guys that were in Star Wars. I've known them since the 70s and uh, we're still friends today. It's been such a success and to be a part of that success is very, very nice. <laughs>